Gordon breaks silence on absolutely crazy Chelsea transfer offers. Anthony Gordon believes transfer fees have gone crazy after Chelsea's high-profile pursuit to sign him over the course of the summer. The 21-year-old was the subject of two bids worth up to £45 million a parcelling, but Everton stood firm and rejected both offers from Stafford Bridge. Gordon, whose club was thought to be asking around £60 million parcelling, remains grounded about the situation but reckons the cash being spent on players is wild. That's football nowadays, it's absolutely crazy, he said, speaking for the first time about the matter. Personally, I don't think any player is worth that amount of money, but I'm also not going to talk myself down. The money in football, that's just how it is nowadays. You're also paying for potential all the time these days. That's just how football goes. I wasn't too focused on that because I can only control what I can control. I think the minute you do that, Thinking he is a 60 million parceling player, that's only one way you're going to go. You need to stay humble, you need to focus on how today and tomorrow, and don't look too far into the future. That's part and parcel of football. When you're doing well, there's always going to be that speculation. But because the place Everton is so good, it's not a place where I'm devastated because I have to stay. That's never been the case. I was never desperate to leave Everton, it was definitely not the case. Gordon helped England under 21s to a 3-1 friendly win over Germany at Bromwell Lane on Tuesday and still holds hope of gate crashing Gareth Southgate senior scored for the World Cup, which gets underway in Qatar in November. If I didn't have the ambition to play for England in the World Cup when I would be a bit stupid, he said. But I understand the squad is so good at the minute that it's going to be really tough to get in. I'm 100% focused on making the World Cup squad. If it doesn't happen, it doesn't happen. It's out of my control, but I'll definitely give it my best try. To get there, I'll need to score a lot of goals in the next couple of games. I'm ready for that challenge, I'm hopeful. Gordon also refused to rule out playing in two international tournaments this season with the Young Lions having reached Euro 2023 next summer. If I had the option to, I'd never say I'm not playing for England at any level, he said. It's not my personality. If I got the opportunity to do both, I'd love that, especially because of the work I've done here. I've played most of the qualifiers, so I'd like to see it out.